Hey there, this is Todd at Biz Ladder. This really short video is gonna talk about adding strike through text to your Wix website. If you're on this video, you probably know what strike through text is. It's just text with a line through it, like what's on the screen here. There's actually a an edit a feature request, excuse me, inside of Wix, a really popular one, to add this as a as an option, as a feature. Uh, we'll link to that in the in the description here. But let's go ahead and dive right in. So First thing you want to do is turn on dev mode if you don't have that. You just go into your editor, dev mode, say turn on. We have it on already. And it'll pop up your little code box down here. Let's move my ugly mug out of the way. It'll add some little default comments and on ready function there, which is what we're going to use, but we'll leave that, that default there. So then we come over, put the code in. All right. Now I'll put this in the comments, by the way. First thing you want to notice here is that every text box has a name. This is called text two. how creative. Uh, you can change that down here if you want to call it something else. If you can have a lot of code on there, you're going to uh, have different people managing it. It's a good best practice to name things appropriately um, and logically. We're just going to leave a text two because, hey, that's what the code we already, that's what's in the code we already wrote. <laughs> All right. So make sure the name of your text box matches text two here, text two here. This is on ready, meaning it, it's going to happen when the page loads. There are some other variations, more complicated ones that we won't get into on this site in this video. But this is it. You add a strike through to any text box, then you can start formatting it. So let's save it. Nope. Let's preview it. Can't see it in the editor. So there you go. You can see it kind of started on without the strike through and it quickly loaded the strike through. So that's it. We're not going to get into a lot of formatting and everything, but this is strike through text. There are a lot of use cases for this. Uh, MSRP pricing is probably the most popular one. Uh, if you have outdated content on a page and you just want to leave it, but strike it through and tell the reader that, hey, this is old. That's a good way to do it. It implies humor sometimes. We're not going to try and make turn this into a, a comedy channel. Um, you can use it to denote completed tasks. There are many, many use cases for this and many other ways to, to work on this. So you can really work with this, excuse me. You can change anything about the uh, 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 text itself. Let's see if animation works. You know what? I don't know. I don't think I've ever tried animation with a strike through. Let's see if that works. It does. Hey, look at that. Awesome. So you could strike through animated text as well. So it looks like that's separate from this, uh, any of the, any of the uh, elements of the text itself, the text box. So that's it. Any questions, uh, reach out, be sure to check out the, uh, the feature request. I'll put that in the description below and vote for this. This is a really simple change that I think Wix could make pretty easily as far as changes go to their platform. And uh, be sure to click that link and vote for it. Reach out to us here at BizLadder if you have any questions.